Hi guys, this is Max from HighOnAndroid.com where we get on Android every day. Uh, anyway, I've got another ROM for you guys for with the Galaxy S2. Uh, I have not forgot about you guys. I've just been flashing a lot of Lollipop ROMs and uh, some of them didn't work out. Um, there is a ROM I can recommend you. I did try out the latest Android uh, 5.1.1 CM 12.1. But I actually don't recommend it at this point. There's a lot of bugs like Wi-Fi not working and stuff. When that's updated, I'll have an update for you. But uh, in the meanwhile, the best one I found uh, for the GTI 9100 uh, is the CM12.1S. This is actually sort of a hybrid between CM12 and a OnePlus One uh, 12S. Uh, it is running Android 5.1. All right, everything you'll find actually same as uh, Sound Digimon because it is based on that. Um, for example, you get all the themes uh, from Sound Gen Mod. All right, you'll get also the Hexo theme. Um, you can go ahead and apply there, uh, which is nice. It comes with it. All right, and also it does come with all the One Plus One apps uh, in this one. And let me go ahead and show you the rest of it. So there you go. So I've got the One Plus One uh, theme here, Hexo theme. Of course, you got the buttons here, menu. Um, this one is not like the latest Android 5.1.1, which allows you to use on-screen navigation buttons with your hardware buttons disabled. That's one thing really cool about Android 5.1.1 uh, with CM 12.1. But uh, again, there's some bugs, so I actually recommend this one. Uh, status bar, customization, notification drawer. I have a whole video on CM 12.1, so check that out if you want to actually customize. Um, but other than that, it's a pretty solid ROM. Uh, it is pretty fast, and I just changed the theme, that's why it seems a little bit slow. Uh, but you get all the uh, regular OnePlus One apps like Audio FX, Camera App. All right, let's actually check out the camera real quick here. Oops, this is, it comes with two cameras actually. <coughs> here we go. So there is my uh, new S6 Edge. I highly recommend it, by the way. You get all of the different themes. Um, it's a straightforward ROM. Now, the only problem I found with this ROM is Netflix is not working. I know there's a Netflix workaround, workaround somewhere out there. But um, this will give you the latest Android 5.1. And this is the most solid one I've found. I've flashed, trust me, I've flashed like at least six or seven in the last week. And uh, this is what I'm running right now. Battery life is okay. I mean, it's not the best I've seen. Um, but uh, you know, if you want to try out the latest Android Lollipop 5.1, check this one out for first. And I'll have an update as soon as a really stable Android 5.1.1 is out. And also, I have another one coming for the AT&T version. Uh, I'll have that soon here. But go ahead and try out this version. At the worst, you can go ahead and make a backup ROM. Try the uh, Lollipop Android 5.1. You can experience it today. Camera working, you know, Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, all that other basic working. So. Just as long as you don't watch a lot of Netflix on it, you should be good. Uh, anyway, thanks guys for watching this video. As always, don't forget to hit that like, subscribe, and as always, uh, stay on Android. And thanks guys for watching this video. This is my second YouTube channel covering the ROMs and my extra videos. If you want to see my main videos, go ahead and subscribe uh, to my main channel over at Zetomax, uh, where I cover stuff like the Nexus 6, the Note Edge, a note for and all the latest Android gadgets and I'll see you guys soon as always stay on Android.